most of them they suffer they go bleeding to work they go starving with diarrhea ha ha it means yes hello my friends and very welcome to my YouTube channel Today we're continuing our conversations with interesting people from all over the world. I have met Inga here in Vilnius, violin player and freelance artist who has worked in cruise ships and traveled all over Japan, China, Korea, Alaska, Canada, Bahamas, Caribbean islands and even my favorite, India. But she ran away in a few weeks time. So let's get started. What would be the most shocking experience you have had working in cruise ships, traveling across different countries? Once I think in South Korea, we lost the ship and we couldn't find. And we had an amazing time in Seoul, now time to come back. But by mistake, we took a wrong train and we saw it very late. So we ran away, we got a taxi and we see the time is coming and we know that we will be fired. We have to find the ship somewhere, <laughs> get there, take our things, get fired, you know. Taxi driver, he doesn't speak English. We were trying to reach anybody to get an address. Uh, nobody was replying. Jesus, it was 20 minutes of my life. My hair would become white if I wouldn't be blonde already. <laughs> is it hard to have uh, privacy? There is no privacy, really. Mm -hmm. Even if you think you are alone, the cameras are there. Every time, always, somebody is observing you, especially if you are in a guest area. If you are in a crew area, you can be a bit more relaxed, but still, they watching you all the time. What the f have your own place to sleep and live, or you have to share it with, with other people? Always sharing. It was impossible for me to avoid conflicts for a half a year. Sometimes it used to be hard, you know, but uh, I learned very quickly that in order not to get into those hard times, mm -hmm. I need to be much more aware of my behavior than mm -hmm. I'm inland. Work experience in India, the most difficult one. I was on illegal contract and basically legal contract in India probably exists, but very, very few. Mine was illegal, so I didn't know that I would need to travel all day and all night in order to get to the performance. In the end, I yeah. used to live in the car, basically. And I got very ill. I got diarrhea. So I was forced to go for the performances. I just left. My violin was taken away because I was explained that uh, according to the contract, I owe a lot of money <laughs> for, for those uh, for those contractors. Yeah, I found friends who were officers in the Ministry of foreign affairs and they really protected me they called those guys who were my bosses and mm -hmm. they took uh, back my things not every girl has it and most of them they suffer they go bleeding to work they go starving they go with diarrhea they go with the fever you don't have health insurance you have really nobody to stand for you over there but uh, in the end you know it was really eyes opening experience <laughs> uh, timing is terrible and uh, people in india they lie a lot i was so stupid i was so naive yeah. leave it to me it means yeah. no way you leave it to him <laughs> you just can trust me before and girls which you meet like, as a colleagues yeah. and they really don't care so tomorrow 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 and then they don't care that maybe you have no money left in your pockets and how you gonna get whatever you need to get nobody cares it was really cruel situations sometimes but i got to learn that india is so huge and so different it's just up to us you need to know how to sort them out <laughs> ha ha it means yes for a sound check you know all the sound engineers they do this <laughs> and you see is it good they go good ha ha and for us it's no like this it means yes is it easy to survive for artists during pandemia Suggestions for those who would like to give it a go after the things get back to normal. We try to work in cruise ship. We really sometimes worry that uh, all those cruise companies, they may get uh, bankrupt. Because to, to keep the company going, to keep the ship, it's millions every month. Like if we thinking how to buy a bread, we don't get into the million debts. I just want to wish everybody big luck, be versatile and find other ways to make living. The world became unpredictable, really. But there is always the exit. Thank you very much, guys, for watching our video. Please put like, dislike, pressing notification bell. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm going to see you next week. Week. Mwah. Ciao.